and simmer fsx simmer 78 785 hey chicho any advice on alcohol i had a blackout the other night and can't remember getting home thanks uh stop drinking stop drinking okay uh simmer uh i've known people that have blackouts too it means you've gone too far you're either having liver problems uh processing the alcohol and if you're doing that then uh you might have any, be having an allergic reaction you might you alcohol might not be for you right or you don't have control over how much you're taking in okay you need to stop drinking if you're blacking out when you're drinking i don't care how much you're drinking if you're hitting it a full bottle or just drinking a few glasses and blacking out the other thing might be is where were you drinking right because if you had only had two or three drinks you didn't pass your limit and you blacked out you might have been uh, your drink might have been tampered with okay so look into recent news of uh, is a roofie is it called roofie it's called something else as well um, oh I forget there's another word for it as well right I was about 10 drinks in were they singles or doubles right uh, simmer were they singles or doubles so for example in victoria my partner told me this last week where 14 people going to this one a pub pints and shots it, how fast did you drink them okay simmer if you drink 10 shots in six hours then anti-social <laughs> 10 beers 10 shots 10 cocktails stop drinking if that's the case uh yeah date rape drug or whatever they call it right but um if you drink 10 shots in 10 hours that's not going to affect you as much as if you drink 10 shots in half an hour right if you drink 10 shots in half an hour there's a reason why you blocked out right so the speed that you add, that you drink matters um and what you're drinking matters right so for example if you're drinking a lot uh, simmer remember uh, remember up to a point then rest is blank also had a cigarette and i don't smoke oh the cigarette might have pushed you over the edge as well don't do that if you've never smoked cigarettes and if you're really drunk you smoke cigarette the odds are you're not feeling it you're inhaling deep and but your body knows it it's already under tremendous amount of stress when it comes to alcohol and you're adding tobacco something you don't smoke before in your system right so don't do that don't mix your drugs that's the other thing but be careful there's a pub in our town where 14 people have been drugged right but supposedly their drinks weren't drugged people were drugging them with the needle so there's something going around right it could be opioids um it could be what do you call it the one that's taking people out um oh god i forget what it's called people will know what it's called I'm going to scroll down someone gives me the name fentanyl it could be fentanyl needles right 14 people from the same pub have reported uh, yeah roofy roofy that's what it is iced roofy that's right uh thank you so 14 people from the same pub uh have been roofied right with a needle not their drinks okay so there's a lot of mental health m issues going around be careful be careful right be careful um i've told my partner too i've told a few people to be careful out there now okay it's dangerous it's dangerous uh, 